Yes, thank you. I can hear you. Yeah, great. If if it's possible to switch the video on, would be better. But what we are doing now is observing the breath. Couple of minutes, just coming back home and feeling the breath going in, going out. Nothing more. Just a couple of minutes to come back home. Yeah, just attention on your breath, breathing going in and out. And as I said before, if any thoughts arise, you let it be. Let the thoughts pass and you stay with your breath. Very simple. Couple of minutes. Just resting in the awareness of the breath. And while breathing and being aware of the breath, we can also notice our forehead, become aware of the forehead, of muscles around the eyeballs. No need to do with it anything, just be aware of it. And through awareness, let it relax. And now we can start moving a bit together, okay? So without losing this state of awareness, yeah, but if you lose, it's also not a problem. You can always return back as you recollect. We will stand up and start doing some movement. Yeah, so if you stand up and we'll start first, we'll make a fist, soft fist, and we will warm up the lumbar area and towards the kidneys. So really you can go with the knuckles of the feet deep and doing some gentle massage to yourself. Yeah, on the back of the body. That's it. And breathing continuous and solar plexus and diaphragm relax. So don't tense, just drop. Okay, now let's relax the hands and we will move from the pelvis. We'll take the pelvis to the right, then forward, then left, and behind. Right, forward, left, behind. So drawing a circle like this, kind of like touching with the lower abdomen, touching a big Circle in front, touching here, touching behind with the tailbone, touching with the right hip. Mm -hmm. Very good. And now we can even place the hands on the back and open the front when you do it, including the throat, all part, front pass. And as our pelvis goes back, the back opens. Very good. Continue a couple more. Continue to be aware of the breath. Allow the breath to breathe itself. Very simple. It knows how to. Allow also the movement to happen so you can be aware of the breath and of the movement. Let's change direction. Open.
Okay. All right. Let's relax. What we will now do, we will sit like this. You see, I'll show from the side. Sit in your in your hips. We call them qua. So you can sit. Yeah. So it's not bending of the knees. It's also not coming forward. It's just body upright and just letting go in the knees, sitting in the chair of the pelvis. That's it. And now we will sink with our awareness down into the ground and then we will rebound, start coming up, coming up, open, open, open the front. And then down, 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 down. Now it's not squatting, right? It's just up and down, but it's different from squatting. We do not want to feel like we are bending the knees with force. No, it's just sitting, relaxing here. I'll show from the side. Let's continue. Open the front and then relaxing, 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 sitting in the chair of the pelvis and coming up slowly, slowly, slowly. Very nice. And let's change the direction. Down, open. And then down, back opens. And here, front opens. And again. And when we go down, you can even bring the elbows slightly more together. So your Shoulder blades also allow the spine to open. Shoulder blades expand slightly to the side. Open, open. Now, when you go up, look what we will do. When you go up, I want you to send your awareness to the back of your heels as you go up. And still you go up, but awareness goes down. And again. This will allow you to relax the muscles of the body as you expand and go up, which is kind of a bit counterintuitive, but the awareness does the trick. So you send the mind to the back of the heel. Very nice. And let's collect the sky. Open. Big, 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 big. And then sitting again. And like pushing a ball into water here. That's it. Let's do it a couple of times. Down, open. Big, big, big to the fingertips. And then down, shoulders sink. And collecting the sky. Very good. Well done. The legs a bit, the legs. And let's now continue with the, with the knee, with the neck. We will breathe in. And as we breathe out, we will gently, gently turn, but very, very soft. Even don't use the full range of movement. Okay. okay. Very, very soft and slow and continuous. And really my invitation here is rest in effortless awareness while being aware of the breath, of the movement, of your facial muscles, of your eyeballs. But also lower abdomen, lower back. Relaxing.
we are not doing an exercise here. We are just abiding in this moment, aware of everything what is passing through, including the movement which our intention initiates. And now let's tilt to the sides very, very softly and gently. And then to another side. And let's bring now the head forward. We do one full circle, very, very soft. And change direction. And again. And again. And let's collect. Open. Very good. That's it. Now let's collect again. And Mirjana, look. Open and sink your shoulders here sink and allow the expansion to go that's it no both hands both both hands. i'm just showing with one hand showing what i mean by when you open send your awareness to the back of the heel and relax allow it to go through the back through the shoulder blades to the fingertips and then down 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 there it goes this way we expand expand in a Qigong way to the fingertips, opening the body. Well done. Relax a bit the legs. Let's continue now with the legs warm up. So we transfer the weight to the right side, left foot on the ball of the foot. And we will do a gentle massage on the ball of the foot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ivan, sit here, relax your knee and sit. Very good, yeah. Rotate on the ball of the foot. Mirjana, am I spelling your name correctly? Is it Mirjana or Mirjana? Mirjana. Mirjana, yeah, I thought, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> A gentle massage to the feet, to the toes of the foot. And change direction. Yeah, while doing it, be aware of your tailbone relaxing down and of the crown of the head too. So this is your center line. Great. And change side. And then change direction. Obviously, don't forget about the breath. Breathing just continuing. So your attention becomes softer when you start watching the breath. It's like when you look forward, 
you recollect about periphery vision and then your central vision softens. You can try it straight away. Notice your periphery vision. You can even sense the space behind you, which you don't see. Let's stand like this now, feet parallel, and we will open to the sides and relax. Then a bit forward and again, open, a bit forward and then open to the side. And let's now try to gather something. We will sit, but then we will go backward and be on the heels and then go forward and raise on the toes. Yeah. Now, what I suggest we will do, so when you go backward, hands go forward. When you go forward, hands relax down. So I'll show you how it looks from the side. You go back, you see, hands go forward. Then you go forward and you raise on the toes and hands relax down. Back and forward. Now, what I suggest we do just to find slowly, slowly the nature of balance is if you feel you are losing balance when you're raising the toes, that's fine, you just step. You don't fight with it, okay? Instead of fighting and trying to balance, just surrender to it and go with the flow. And if you go forward, and you feel you lose balance, also you can step. Very good, Mirjana, but it's, it's opposite direction. Look, when you go backwards, let's go backwards and hands go forward. Try it with me, yeah, that's it. So you go on the heels and hands open forward to help you a bit with the balance. Then you go forward and hands relax. Backwards, forward. Yeah. And yeah, don't fight for the balance even slightest. If needed to step, just go with it and step. Continue a couple of times. Just coming a bit to see you. Very good. Well done. Okay, let's relax a bit. Let's continue with the warm up. We put our right leg a bit behind, left leg forward, and we warm up the knee. Some friction around the patella, around the knee joint. If you want to do it while seated, it's also possible. Yeah, and breathe. And behind also. That's it. And then change side. And behind. And then let's stand and Relax now your ankles and hips so your spins and thighs can move. And we will do a bit of this movement, but gently, gently, very gently. So you just draw a bit of a circle. You're doing circular movement. That's it. And then change direction. Great, and now straight, let's make it straight and press it. In. So here it stretches, so you can press in. And then sit a bit, comfortably. And then again, straight and seated. Again, straight, and this time we will relax down. So relax your hands, relax your head, neck, and just let's be couple of moments in this relax. Allow the gravity, gravity to pull you down. And breathe. 
and rest a bit. Very good. And then try to touch your toes, straighten the legs a bit, then see and push from your feet. When wrists in front of the knees, tailbone relaxes down, tucks in slightly, you start rolling of the spine, vertebra after vertebra. And then the head goes up to the last. Very good. And we collect. Open. Very nice. Let's relax, shake your legs a bit. And we will continue now. We're starting from the central axis. Yeah, allow the hands just to hang completely loose. Yeah, just turning your pelvis. Very soft. Watching the breath, watching the movement, being aware. And now we will transfer the weight and turn on the, on the heel like this. That's it. Weight goes to the right, weight goes to the left. Then weight goes to the right. Continue. Ivan, look. When are we doing the same? Let's do again. Again, I am not sure I saw. Let's do again. Don't worry. Let's just repeat. Okay. Yeah. Relax, relax your hands. Don't raise the hand. Just keep them loose and down. That's it. Very good. And now we will do the following. We will transfer the weight to the left and turn to the left too. That's it. And pivot on the ball of the back leg, on the toes of the back leg. And look far. Be aware of your crown of the head. This way we also engage a bit of the lymphatic system here inside the groin. Because we are closing one hip, then we're closing another hip. <coughs> All right. Well done. Relax a bit. And we continue. Ready? We are holding the sky. We're going down. Push from both feet slowly, slowly. And then continue to push from both feet coming up. Slow and continuous movement and holding the sky. And then start relaxing. Slowly, slowly. Shoulders sink, elbows drop, and then wrists sit. And again. When you go up, send your awareness to the back of the heels, remember? So the body can relax as you come up. That's it. And again. Experiencing the stretch to the fingertips and then experiencing the relaxation. Slow, continuous, smooth movement.
And now when we arrive to hold the sky and have this opening and the stretch, keep the stretch and open to the side. Keep the stretch and then let go of the stretch. Feel the relaxation. And again, open. Remember to rest in the awareness. So it's exercise is just going on its own accord. Obviously following your intention, but intention is not something you need to keep control of. Intention is subtle. You just have an intention and it happens. It's happening and you can rest and see it happening. Listen to the movement happening feeling the movement happening. And we collect, open. Very nice. Let's collect, let's relax a bit. Shake your legs. And we will continue now this, how you feel guys. You're not very tired. If you want to drink, we can do a minute break. That's fine. Yes. Feeling yes. okay, Miriana? Okay. Yeah, okay, then let's continue if you're happy. So we will now do separating heaven and earth. It will yes. work on our stomach and spleen a bit. So we go down, we push from both feet, one hand goes down, one hand goes up. We create a diagonal stretch through the stomach. And look, Miriano, this hand here, to the side of the thigh, here, yeah, and sit it, the, the, your right hand. Bring it like this. You look, I'll come closer. See, this way. And down, really down, more down, more down. Down, more, yes, exactly. And not back, slightly forward, that's it. Yes, and open, but when you're opening, relax your shoulders so the body is not tilting. The body is aligned from the center. Feel the stretch and then start relaxing. Down, 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 down. Hands meet at the level of the heart. And then we rebound from the feet and we come up slowly, 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 slowly. And another side, that's it. Very good, very well, yeah, well done. I come a bit closer to see you too. Well done, Ivan. Down. And rebound from the feet. And down, down, more down, yeah. Really relax, that's it. No need to push and lock, but just relax down and then a bit of a push into the middle of the palm, that's it. So, down, rebound. And again.
and both hands now go down and we collect open and start sinking shoulders sink elbows drop what Ivan? I got I thank I thank you Dmitri for what what you show and yeah, it's very good but sensation is good. Great. I'm very happy to hear this. Now I would like to show you what internal movement means because it's not really external exercise we are doing, right? We are trying to engage something internal. And internal means that we usually people are not familiar with it. This is a different experience which most of the people never experience. So I would like to introduce you a bit to internal movement. So let's stand and sit like this, relax. Yeah. And don't do any movement in particular, right? Don't do. All I'm asking you now is to send your awareness to the back of the heel. And now send your awareness to your toes. Back of the heel, toes. Can you feel some movement happening in the body? Just from as a result of switch of your awareness. Back of the heel. I feel change like parasympathicus or some some kind of uh, uh, release of side some some of release that's great yeah and that, the fact that you speak about parasympathetic nervous system it's very beautiful obviously we can okay. talk a lot about this but today let's just experience so send to the back of the heels and then to the toes miriana can you feel the movement happening in the body yes the relaxation? yes, yes yeah, thank it's, you it's as Ivan said, it's a release, right? The muscles relaxing. And as a result, we have the movement. So this is the beginning of recognition of inner movement. In Qigong and Tai Chi, we are not, ideally, it becomes an effortless practice. Why it's effortless? Because it comes from parasympathetic, like Ivan said. It comes from intent and rest. And the movement then can happen internally it happens it looks to people that the movement is happening right it looks that there is an expansion right it looks like we are moving right it looks like it but it it happens not because we are doing it with muscles it's intent driven yeah while the mind and rests in awareness this is why it meant that Tai Chi and Qigong is effortless. It doesn't mean that the body doesn't do the work. It does, but it does it from relaxation. What I mean, we can try together. Let's try. See? Yeah? And then as you sit, feel the rebouncing from the ground. Relax from the feet, like opening the feet and muscles start sinking. And then feel when the ground starts rebouncing you back. And then again, relax. And feel the ground start rebouncing you back. Now again, go down and feel like it, it expands slightly. Can you feel that the hands, yeah. the shoulder blades expanding slightly? Yeah, is that? That's exactly. So oh, actually yeah. the movement of the hands, even when they go up, can be done from relaxation and sinking. It's different from, from this. You see, this is muscular, local movement. Yeah. And, yeah. and this is whole body. Whole body, when I mean whole body, it's relaxing and expanding. So the movement of expansion comes from relaxation because the ground force then can be transmitted from the ground to the fingertips through the body. And the movement down is also relaxation and sinking. 
Yeah. And yeah, very, very, very nice man here, man. You do it well, well done. Very charming, nice. charming anticipation. You do very nice. Great. Yeah. I agree. And, yes. <laughs> what? I you agree. Are yeah, I, it, it's great that you see it because it, you probably explored this a bit, but yeah, it's possible to develop it. Everyone can with the right guidance, that's for sure. Yeah, try it with me. What I'm asking you to do, I didn't plan to explain this, but we can still do it because it can be useful for you. Imagine your body is full of water. Yeah, and now imagine you have two tubs of water in your feet. So when you, what is sinking process? You just open both tubs of water and water starts going down from the feet. And this creates space for upper water to come down and for upper water to come down. Mm -hmm. wow. Yeah, so this is the sinking process. When we relax from upper body, the muscles which are relaxing, meeting the non-relaxed yet muscles and rebouncing back, so it doesn't work. But when you do it from the feet, then whole body changes. Yeah, so you can just imagine you open two tubs of water and the water starts coming out from the middle of the foot. And this means your foot goes deeper into ground and then calf muscle relax, thigh muscle relax, whole body melts after it. And then again, open two tubs of water. And again, open. Just feel how it opens and starts the opening from the feet. Can you feel, Mariana? Yes, I'm going down. <laughs> Yeah, you, you don't need to, you can, it can be accompanied by going down, but not necessarily because it's internal. So your foot opens and goes internally, like into the ground, relaxing. Okay. Yeah, and again, open. And again, you can do it very fast even, one after another. It doesn't require effort. It's, it's good. Great. So this is the stinking process. Right. This is right. where the internal movement starts to come from. Let's continue a bit with our Qigong and now you can start using it. So we'll go down, coming up a bit, continue coming up and we will push two big mountains to the side. Open, open, open to the middle of the palm. That's it. And when you open, remember to send your awareness to the back of your heels, relax down. Feel the stretch. And then start relaxing. Shoulders sink, elbows drop. Slowly, slowly, slowly. And then down. So now we are engaging a bit the lungs and large intestine here. Open, open, open. Feel the stretch. This is the young phase. And then feel the relaxation, which is the yin phase of the movement. And again. Does following us has to connect or want to be uh, disturbed to what, what to do with my phalanx to connect them in the with, medium position or to with endure. what with, with, with arms and do my fingers phalanx, you okay. know. Let me show it a bit. Close, look. 
When you go up, you arrive here, then you sink your awareness to the feet as you go up. And then you do sit the wrist and you push from the middle of the palm a bit outwards, you see? Yeah. It's, it's kind of outwards movement, you see? I, I'm showing a bit of internal movement here, yeah? But it's, and then it goes to the fingertips. So meridian stretch. In this case, meridians of these two fingers, especially, which is lungs and large intestine. Yeah, so you yeah. actually, but to make the stretch, look, Mariana, I think it can be useful to you. To make the stretch, you don't push from the muscle. You relax from the feet, like we discussed. You relax, shoulder relax, and then shoulder blade expands on its own accord to the middle of the palm, you see? Yeah. Like this, yes. So your hands are then being held by the ground, by the structure of the body. And then you start relaxing from both feet. Slowly, 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 you relax. Relax doesn't mean become floppy. You keep the structure, you relax the muscles inside the structure, inside the vessel. And then you push a bit, like ball into water. You see? So we have, we have, the movement is not as simple as it seems, but let's do it. So we open. And then we expand. This is a big stretch here. Yeah, when you go towards the stretch, really feel stretch. Mariana, you can bring the hands a bit higher, a bit, and then relax the shoulder. That's it. Very good. She's name is Miriana. Miriana. Miriana, yes. yeah. Did I, sorry if I said differently. Now, start sinking from the feet. Shoulders sink, elbows drop. Yeah, and experience the relaxation. This is big relaxation. And then there is a small stretch here. Small stretch. And then small relaxation again. And it starts again. So four phases. Big, big young. And big in. Breathe obviously. Small young and small in rebounds from the feet. Yeah, Mariana, bring it higher. A bit. That's it. Higher, but then send your awareness to the back of your heels. So it's being held by the ground. And then And down. Uh, and last time. Experience the stretch. Experience the relaxation. Very good. Down, down, down. Well done, Maria. Miriana, let's collect. Open, 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 open. Shake your legs a bit. Shake your legs. Rest a bit. And let's do also the water exercise. So a bit of bladder and kidneys. So what we will do it will start very similar to this exercise, which was a metal exercise. So we will go up, similar to how we did, but then we will go down and we will sit and expand to the kidneys like this, look. So kidneys, tailbone goes down, kidneys open, and you push forward to emphasize the opening of the kidneys. Yeah, when you push forward, Mariana, look, Push like this, yes, that's it. But more, think of expansion, like imagine you're pushing against the wall and as a result, your kidneys expand. Your expansion goes here into the back. So let's try together. Open and then sinking.
Very good. Then start coming up. Shoulders sink, elbows drop, and then go down and sit the wrist. Very good. And let's do it together. Open. Push from your feet, shoulders sink, elbows drop. Down, sitting of the wrist. And again. Shoulder sink, elbows drop. Up and down. Expanding while going down. Then up. Shoulders sink, elbows drop. And then sitting of the wrist. Yeah. One last time. Shoulder sink, elbows drop, and down. Very good. Well done. And let's collect. Open, open, open. Very nice. Relax your legs a bit, shake. And I think we will finish our practice with opening Tai Chi movement, which opens almost any Tai Chi form in any Tai Chi style. Let me show you. We sink, hands go down, and then we rebound from both feet. We come 90% up. And then we start sitting. Shoulders sink, elbows drop, and wrists sit. And hands return to the sides of the thigh. I'll show from the side. Do you see? Down. Hands become very long. From both feet, opening, 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 opening. Sending the awareness to the fingertips. Then sitting, shoulders sink, elbows drop, wrists sit. And again. Breathing, <coughs> elbow relaxes. Big, 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 like touching the horizon with your finger. Down, and then sit the wrist, Mariana. Sit the wrist, that's it. And again, from the feet, open, 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 open. Forward, so really hands long, look, look, hands doesn't go like this. And go big, big, big forward, like you want to touch the horizon. That's it. Well, well done. And then sit, shoulders sink, elbows drop, and sit the wrist. Here, yeah, sitting of the wrist. Start sitting of the wrist even here. So let's do it again. Long, 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 long. And then shoulders sink, elbows drop, and then start sitting of the wrist. Start sitting of the wrist, Miriam. What I mean by sitting is this, like this, yeah? So look, it's it's here. Start sitting the wrist in. Oh, wrist. That's it, yes, 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 yes. Yeah. And again, long, long, long. Open, 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 long opening. Relax your wrist, relax your fingers. That's it, and then shoulders sink, elbows drop and sitting of the wrist, sit, sit the wrist, that's it. Then it can reach the fingertips. Yeah, the blood, the lymph, and then can circulate fully through the wrist and reach to the very, very end of the meridians, of the blood vessels, of, of the lymph vessels. Down, open, open, open.
Big, big, big. Mm -hmm. Very good. So what we have here, it's like a whip movement. Shoulder first, then elbow, then wrist. And then again, shoulder, elbow, wrist. That's it. Breathe and look far. Look, look far. Experience the movement. Yes. Instead of doing the movement, even if the movement is not perfect and doesn't yeah. matter now. Yeah, just be That's here. Totally. Yeah. Just be here, look far, notice the periphery vision, and just be in the moment. Shoulders sink, elbows drop. Very sweet. Very good. That's it. Big, 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 send it forward. And then shoulder sink, elbows drop. Breathe. One more. All right, and let's collect. Open, big, 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 big. And then down. And again, you can imagine a fresh energy enters like a shower from above through your body, washes the whole of the body. And the energy which was already utilized goes back to the earth through your feet. And again, big, big, big. Very good. Relax your legs. And now we will do some cool down exercises. So in, now when we are a bit energized and energy is flowing, we will use the he hand as the sh shower head. Yeah, from the middle, imagine it's showering water or energy. And we will make bring the right hand up, right hand up like this, long, long gap. Yeah, Miriana, yeah, that's it. And with the left hand, we will wash it. So we go out on external side and then in on internal side. And then we go around the shoulder blade, out and in, out and in. Breathe. And let's change side. Out on external side of the hand, yeah, on the upper side of the palm, and then in on internal and around the shoulder blade, and again. Yeah, and be here now, experience this washing. And now let's bring the right hand again forward, but relax it, relax, allow it to be even inside floppy, so it's all shake. Make a soft fist with the left hand, and you will tap a bit. Go out, forward, and then return on the inner side. Very soft, without force, you don't uh, kick, yeah? You just do very soft tapping to shake a bit, to, to redistribute the energy all over the body, all over the limbs. And another hand. Yeah. Oh. Very good. And now the trapezius muscle where you like someone do that doing a massage. Place the middle finger of the left hand on the right 
trapezius muscle. And then with the left hand, with the right hand, sorry, you can press on top and pull it a bit in like this. Open. And another side, same thing. Very good. And now we will tap on the legs, look, on the legs and we will go down. And then we will return up. Very good. And up and down. And now open big, big, big. And really you deserve a big loving hug so you can relax in it. And again, big, big, big and give yourself a good hug. And open again and well done. Beautifully practiced. You did really well. Thank you Thank for coming you. and I hope you enjoy. Thank you very much. I have to apologize. I didn't know what we were doing. It just Facebook surprised me at eight o'clock and I just joined. And I great. don't have any experience with Tai Chi or any anything similar. That's great. Thank That's you. great. Really yeah. great. It doesn't matter. I'm glad you guys enjoyed. I if you enjoyed and would like to donate something, there is the link in the event on the Facebook. So you can use it if you want. It's not a must. Uh, any questions? When you speak about in intention and uh, how to follow on uh, by uh, and free yourself of the mind and about it, you say that uh, uh, if we saw you know, what we are chance we want to have to to look on uh, we could do what's needs for it like that you know if you follow yeah. what 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 is intention but you say it, it's mind and that it I, will, I would not i would not call it mind yeah, yeah. you you say it's about about separate of the mind you you say but sub separate, but uh, how how we can uh, acquisition that free chapter of that so we can be on intention more intrinsic or of, of I understand. It. I understand. Yeah, it's it's a process. It's a process. How you release the mind control from anything, right? How you release? You don't. You cannot release because when you try to release, you use the mind. So any mm -hmm. trying is the mind. So you surrender. You say, I can. And in this surrender, it happens by itself. Look on your eyes now, right? So you, yeah. cannot, you cannot do relaxation. You cannot do awareness. These are things beyond what our mind can control. But we are trying to reach it because we've been taught like this in school. Whatever we want to achieve, we need to work on it to happen. We need but to look on. <laughs> we yeah. need to look on. Exactly. Yeah. And what can really help is a very simple practice. We can even do it now one minute. Just watch your breath. Sit and watch your breath. You don't need to do anything. Just breathe in, breathe out and be in the moment right anything thoughts can rise you don't need to push them away feelings can rise emotions can rise you don't fight any of this you welcome and even not welcome there is nothing you need to do you're just aware and you rest in it this is where your parasympathetic starts having a chance to switch on 
deeper and deeper. It's not that you achieve it, yeah? It's going deeper and deeper as you, as you just allow it to happen more and more in your life. So you let go of control. You, you tell the truth to yourself that you don't really know, that you don't really can control. And you watch your breath, as simple as that. So you can really let go of control of the life because life is uncontrollable. Yeah, we are just, we are small human. We came here like this and we will go. Yeah. So, but, but, yeah. Yeah, but we can allow the life to live through this vessel. <laughs> then we kind of surrender to something bigger than us bigger than the mind and we become that in that surrender we become one with them very good yeah well done Mariana well done thank you yeah you, you both are shining there so it's just a matter of awareness just just understand that you can let go you can rest even when you're in the middle of activities, right? This is all about martial arts too, not just energy and health. So you can work in martial applications and do fast forms. This is a bit more advanced stage and be completely, totally surrendered and relaxed inside. Yeah, if we let things to make harder, that, that is make them more harder. If, but if we, we look, Wherever we can make things more productive, you know. Exactly. We, we exactly. make our, our decision by, by the own self, you know. I'm trying, right. I'm doing, and well, it was nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, boss. Thank you. Thank you for coming and have a good evening. Yeah, and very good week. Was, it was my first appear, but it was very, very classful. You have class, man. You, you are good. Yeah. So I hope to see you in the future. I hope you will come to next sessions. Nice. Thank you. Nice. This was great. Very new for me. Thank you. Great. I'm glad. Bye. Bye. Good night. Good night.